please stop. Don't make me blush. It hurts my skin. <laughs> but no, forget me. Fred. Definitely. Wouldn't be here without him. Ooh, we'd be like watching TV or something. Or, ooh. Oh, ooh. or like going outside communicating with people. Interaction. What is that? Oh, it's scary out there, man. It's like people in germs and traffic. Oh. So here we go, you all. Game three about to get on the way to south. We're going to break this dog on tower right now and see who's moving on to the finals. Here. This is so exciting. Yes, it is. <laughs> yes, it is indeed. So here we go. Game three between the Sky Bills and Mitch Flapper. The winner will move on to the finals on Saturday. What's a TV? It's like a really thick monitor. Instead of plugging into the computer, you plug it into your wall. World it's one. Cool. World one. What is this? Come on, one, one. Oh, Dang, no. So close. Sometime we're going to get it. We're going to get it. Yeah. So we're starting off with the sun level in one, one. Got a baby. You know, not a baby Chi Chi, but a normal Chi Chi. Ain't Almost got cute? Styles. Ain't it cute? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the fun thing about that little baby Chi is the minute you run off screen, it respawns like a couple seconds later in front of you. So Mitch is kind of keeping it on screen to avoid yeah. the death. He's just walking his cheek cheek. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Oh my goodness. It's gotta be a little more aggressive, so she's gonna look the, the the race has already been decided, right? Yep. Yep. Sky's got a lead. Let's go. So again, very nasty enemies That's down here. Right. Fire charms, fire snakes. Ooh. Again, this is one of those beta levels. Again, for those who don't know, there are eight stages included in the randomizer pool of levels that are basically beta stages, early designs of official levels that made it into the game itself, final right. release. And so they are mixed in, so they may see, and that was one of them. So if you are curious to know what has been randomized in this, you can go to SN, uh, exclamation point SMB3. Go to, uh, there's a paste bin link at the bottom of that. Let you know what's, yep. uh, what's all shuffled around. Uh, that also includes Mario's color. See Sky with the, the standard red and Mitch with the passion pink. That's right, passion pink, y'all. Passion pink. Again, the, the color of Mario does not affect the scene. It does of course. Not. Yeah, and for those who are too lazy to download randomizer, you can play in other such colors besides the red and passion pink, such as pale blue. Dungeon, Dungeon Green. green. Oh, <laughs> I love Dungeon Green. And how about uh, white and yeah. sky blue? There's also a random option that yeah. gives you other colors that you can't normally choose as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mitch was actually going for the clip there. That clip oh. is, what, sub-pixel perfect. Pixels so small that you can't even see them anyway. Can't even see. So, good old 7-7. Seven, seven. Yeah, even Again, though uh, yeah. power-ups are shuffled, these have to remain stars in order to progress. Now, if they got good, you don't have to worry about it. Hey. Someone said you could P-Wing under that. I'm, I'm trying to see how you're going to P-Wing underneath that that low-clearance pipe and yeah. not actually touch the muncher. Maybe a Tass will do it or something. I don't know. Yeah. But I'll totally give you $1 if you do it in real life. All right. Sign me up. I didn't say horizontal thumps. I said diagonal, not horizontal. Yes. There's only well, actually horizontal thumps. How many horizontal thumps are there? There's only there's two, two I'm horizontal. In, yeah, in. I said diagonal. Yeah, horizontal would be seven fort. Uh, I'm sorry, world eight fort and um, world the uh, world. What you call it? World seven, world six fort three. No, I'm sorry, world six fort two. Those are your two horizontal thwomps. Yep. Sky first into the airship here. Mitch shortly behind. Auto scrollers have been disabled. That includes airships. Auto, for the most part, there are a couple of stages that are remaining yep. auto scrollers, but uh, we'll get to those later if they come. So here we go. Let's see how challenging our first Koopa Kid fight is. Not too much happening here. Too bad. Got a lot of hits, though. Yeah, more than three. Uh, Koopa Kid's HP can be shuffled between one and five hit points, with your standard being three. Yeah. Both finishing up almost about the same time. Pretty close. 
Horizontal thump in World Four. Yeah, I'm, I'm saying I'm literally thinking about the thump. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Yeah, yeah right. World Four Fork One. The upper path. We'll take you, give you the other one. So you got three horizontal. See, I asked about diagonal. I knew that answer. They want impressions. Here's my impression of a commentator. <clears throat> Man, we have a really close race here. And, and there we go. See? Yeah, indeed we do. See how to do that? We're amazing. Hire us for like <laughs> our mitzvahs and all that good stuff. Right? Get our contact information after them. That's right. We have a business email. We'll let you know. Oh, got so we got the, did you see the green tanuki there? Yeah, right? <laughs> what is this? That was great. So we have, we have cloned and merged a frog with a bear. <laughs> What is really going on here? Looking for that hammer using the anchor. Not quite it. Yep. Yeah. So, of course, you see them both playing match. Of course, you see a different layout because what matching game is all their eight layouts, but uh -oh. they are frame dependent. Sky getting a match and picking up a hammer. She's going to oh go back boy. and skip these stages. Can you believe that, yo? So, of course. Um, I'm not sure which Adam the Hammer match to actually. I missed I it. Yeah. This is why we have chat because we have yep. to ignore something so you all can pay attention. Yeah, they'll, 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 they'll correct this. It's no big deal. And <laughs> another Hammer. Another Hammer, man. So Mitch will obviously pick up that Hammer soon. It, of course, he's not going to have a chance for matching again until 160,000 points every 80K. Yeah, hopefully and here he... we. Oh boy, remember this? Well, yep, I remember this. We've seen this what a couple times now. Going through boy. that clip with the tail. So See again, how many times it takes. So Scott has no other option around this now. I don't think she has a P wing either. So, so she's just gonna say bump it. Let's just go ahead and play it. So again, another chance to actually see um, level seven six being played is normal way. Getting a rare view of all your directional blocks that you don't Great. see too often. Yeah. One of only a couple stages that has this? Or is this the only stage that has this? Um, you can find them here, and you can also find them in uh, Fort, in World 4, in the fort, when you take the door. Okay. No, I'm sorry, that's not right. That's not right, I'm sorry, I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Yeah, World, World 4, Fort 2. Please tell me I'm right. I'm, dude, I'm trying to remember all these dogs on levels. It's, it's, I never realized how... Dude, right? until you started commenting, it's like, God, all these levels. There's a ton of levels. <laughs> yeah, World Four, World 442, if you hit the P-switch and go on the door, there's a little mini area that has those. You know, I've never been there. I'll have to check it out later. Yeah, who goes there? Anybody got time to be sightseeing in a Mario game? Mitch does grab the power-up. We didn't know if that was going to be there because uh, Guy, when she came in here, already had his Nuki suit. Yeah, Mitch so fortunately... Yeah, I'm glad you did, man. That's a very, very valuable item to miss. Oh, yeah. Sky did lose a little bit of time having to go through the stage normally. We'll see if uh, Mitch gets a first oh, try. Look, look at that. Uh, with the tail, that is not easy to do. That is quite impressive there, man. He'll gain a little time just on that, because Sky's actually backtracking getting Hammer Brothers trying to find some items here. Now, mind so, you, remember, Sky did a matching game already and picked up a Hammer. Right. Mitch hasn't done it, hasn't matched it yet. So again, that's something that he'll have advantage of later. If he makes that match, yes. Yeah, if he makes that match. So with there being so many Hammer Brothers, you literally don't not play them. Is that English right? Sounds about right. Don't <laughs> not. Don't not even not play them. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I gotta get over. I need some paper to work this one out. So for sure you're gonna play on free items. Well not necessarily free, but right. Uh, early on, it's definitely, it seems like it's out of the way to go for these, but uh, they do allow you to pick up, they can allow you to pick up hammers and clouds, which allow you to skip stages, which could be more beneficial in the long run. <laughs> Don't it? Oh my god, that's a great job. That's the best word ever. <laughs> Don't it? <laughs> that, that double contraction in the same in the same word? I don't think my mouth can even say that word. Don't it? Oh boy. So again, a lot of we got hammers and clouds in play right in inventory. Let's take an upper path. Yeah, a little bit of a route divergence here between two yeah. stages. Have to use the watcher step here. I don't want to fall on those. I don't think there's ooh, any other. Ooh, 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 keep boy. Out of the... Oh, is that is gonna sit there. Yeah, again, and in the random map, those that same cheap cheap we saw at the very first stage. 
has the exact same properties of boss bass. They can also move up vertically. Right. Whoo, Scott almost took out the face of the hammer brother there. So you have to be careful when you're going upwards. That was the right at the end of the stage there too. We just had to go through that vertical pipe for the exit. Yeah, so give me a couple minutes, I might be able to. Nice music there. So here we go. Yeah, by the way, the, the music, I think, did you mention about the music? I'm sure you did. I haven't gotten there yet, but oh, the music good. is can be shuffled. It's an option. Yeah. So normally expecting airship music, you get the doon da doon da Yes. Maximum doon da doon da Oh, yeah. I should let it be an email by now. <laughs> so again, a little hopping, bobbing, and weaving through the the non-fast airship now. Scott Bills, Mitch, about to wrap up World Two here. I am behind on tracking. Apologies. I tell you, I know I you had one job. Your application. I here. had one job. Well, I'm guilty too. I could have changed it too, man. <laughs> Just so like, the match is so uh, gaugy. You know? So focused on randomizer final. You know what? There are a few of us who have submitted Mar the Mario Three random DQ. So who knows? Hey, let's see what happens. Like to see so, that? That's for sure. You know, it's a two versus two action here. So, bitch, give some doing the doing the action. Again, a little bit ahead of of Sky. Of course, Scott. Interesting enough, Scott did take advantage of the hammer though so again even though the lead is not that big mitch still has that advantage a little bit later whenever he gets a chance to match successfully right. they both picked one up from a hammer brother which gives them all we'll be even on that on that level yeah in so that regard. so this time mitch is not busting the hammer yeah it's a bit I'm of a gamble a yeah that's interesting to do that now because he did that last time well the previous race Right. They put him right behind the other one. So, so we're going to see what Sky does. Again, boy, we are really having some clip wars today between yeah. 7 and 7 6. Man. It's, and the, every time they have a tail. It's, it's funny how that's happened uh, each time. We've seen it more than once. And, Is she going to know? Ooh, Sky she, was contemplating. Oh, yeah. She changed her mind. She's going back. Uh oh. She's, like, she's trying to figure out what she wants to do. Yeah, it's a, it's a tough decision because if this other pipe she's heading towards leads to the other fortress and behind that lock, you're stuck. Yeah, this is, gonna this is going to be interesting. So right now, both our players are on different paths and we don't know who's going to win. For, you know, almost the same amount of levels, but we don't know what levels and which pipe, of course. Yeah, it's one of those situations where a decision can make a big difference. Yeah. See, if it, see if it plays out or see how it plays out. Yeah, who knows? They might meet the same time at the victory pipe. Who knows? Yeah, Sky may, may may have taken the gamble just because she thinks she might be behind a little bit. Yeah. Uh, so she's even gonna... though she did use that hammer previously. Yeah. So whatever she whatever she got the hammer from is be the start of, of the fly, which is on the board again somewhere. Um, so maybe she'll get lucky and match it up. Yeah. So that would then that would give her a two hammer advantage over Mitch right now already. Just as far as you know, opportunities to right. skip stuff. So she'll have seven, eight. I'm sorry, uh, three, eight, and three, nine, to see if that pipe will take her somewhere. If she's and like I said, if she's behind that lock, trouble. Because she'll have to go all the way back around and follow the path that Mitch is already on. Yeah, I mean, that's fun. Yeah. So man, this is really interesting, man, because they're very, very close to the same thing. Mitch is going to fly out of here. And of course, that brings up the hmm. You don't know what's going to be above here, so Mitch has to watch his dome piece. He's going for the clip. Could yeah, be going is, for the clip. Yeah, oh. This, so Mitch gets the clip, so he's going to go straight to the end of the level here. Quite some time. Yeah, avoiding having to fly up to that that pipe normally, avoiding really limited, whatever enemy that it could have been. See, this is the time where when, the, when that that miscellaneous practicing you do on stream pays off, and you just get the clip you need. But it may not matter. Let's see what happens. Scott Bill's moment of truth right here. And oh, oh no. no! So this was really interesting because had it been the other pipe, they would have actually met together 
Yeah. At the castle. So That's she's tough. gonna have to do a little bit more stuff. Um, not that much, honestly, because the bridge is down. Uh, otherwise, she would just taken that death with the bridge having to bend her. So Mitch's gonna take the bomb regular power up here. So right now, as far as who's ahead, um, they're kind of really close to each other. Mitch is probably just barely ahead, just because of routing choices. Um, Sky is probably behind by a couple of couple of, by a couple of Heron brothers, and of course one fort. Uh, well, actually, probably two more than that. Two stages. So Mitch would have the lead right now because we all know that the correct by process of elimination, the correct pipe is the bottom, the bottom center pipe. Mitch is gonna pick up another inventory item here. Yeah, ads are. Yeah, typically, and the good thing about the funny thing about the Mario Three randomizer is that it opens up the entire level pool to everything that will be part of a hundo run. Unless you watch someone that runs hundo, you just wouldn't see these so many stages, you know? Even if you do, there are some stages that are in the game normally that you'll see as well. Yep, yep. So every time you put, if you if you play the randomized like setting, there would still be stages you would not see just because there are more levels in the pool than there are available to play in the game. Or should I say specifically, there are more levels in the pool than actual stages you can play on the maps right. in total, you know. Got Mitch fighting Wendy. I think that was two hits. And Sky used the cloud to get over the fortress. She's right behind them here. Yeah, again, trying to catch up there. Again, having an inventory cut that lead down. Again, it is minus one cloud for her, but again, Mitch still... He'll have a he'll have a matching game. Well, he just did the matching actually. I don't know what he did or what he matched. I think it was some uh, like a ten coin and a twenty coin. So we'll see what it is when we check the inventory. RNG anchor again, which was what uh, Tanuki. So he has one cloud, man. Mitch having those double clouds there. Using the hammer to skip a few stages here and a second. Look he at might that. Cloud this one. Good. Yep. He could go all the way. So again, <laughs> there's your there's your perfect example of being able to take a level that would require stages to zero, just the castle at the end. A zero so, stage roll. Yeah. Doesn't happen very often, but pretty nice when it does. Yeah, you definitely have to have the inventory for it. Of course, remember Sky used um, a, another hammer. She's right, minus baby. one hammer. Right. Yeah, so, ooh, that hammer. Mm. So unfortunately, that's gonna put Scott behind by about three stages now. Yeah, about that. Um, because of that. Again, that's this is this is just one of the things about the randomizer, man. The you use your items and then. Um, Fortunately, you need them right after. It was it was it was literally a a green tanuki. <laughs> it, it was a little little strange. I don't know what's going on. That that may be too hot for TV. I think. So we got World Seven here, and that played a difference last match, just based yeah. on routing. See what happens this time. With overworld pipes being shuffled around, uh, could be really really lead to a pipe maze. Not knowing where you're going, that's mm -hmm. why I clipped. Yeah, I'm yeah. Chuck saying. Chuck did that yesterday. Like every time he got to look, <laughs> Mitch has to make sure he ones up Chuck at least ties when he does there. But here we go. Scott Bills is uh, she's clearing the path. She's gonna flop for the item here. She tried this last time. Uh, change time got in the way, but not this time. Yeah, so she is taking a very big gamble here. Again, this this is significant lower. Right, but it does lead to an item, which not many players uh, players go for since it does. It is a bit slower. Yeah, so she needs to fly. Normally, this is what gives you a music box. Uh -oh. Yeah, we don't we we don't want to fly as statue. <laughs> statue fly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you have to actually press down before it. So she's definitely hoping for a hammer or a cloud here. Really nothing else, honestly. Right. 
And that is disappointment right there. Yeah. Not what you want to see there. Uh, Mitch did uh, skip over these Karen brothers, though. At least one of them. Yeah. Not sure what he skipped over. Um, right. There's uh, a cloud. Yeah. Wow. Uh -oh. That's literally what she was looking for. She got both of them. So, with this only being the fourth world for her, that's that's a pretty valuable pair to have. It's a nice find. Yeah, man. So, again, that might backfire on Mitch a little bit. Later. No. You know, this is one of the things, you know, it, it may seem like Sky had a bad break. You know, from the previous world, you know, going the wrong way, but I'm telling you, when it results in having very valuable items. Yeah, we, we've seen this before in a, in a previous round of the tournament where Sky was in this position where she was behind, but uh, picking up some extra items from Hammer Brothers or in card game eventually led her to the victory. Indeed, it does. Mitch is still looking for that that pipe leading to the leading towards the airship. Yeah, got to get to that right side here. And oh boy, on the 345 island here. Not a place we'd like to be any means. Because no matter which way you come from, you're literally gambling. Right. Unless you've already been through one of the other pipe hexes, hexes and whatnot, so. Yeah, World 1 was done. World 1 was the actual first world. Yep. Yeah. So they're done with World 1's map. They're done with 3's map. They have done uh, World 4's map. And 2. So they've done one. 1, 2, 3, and 4. Yeah. Here we are on 7. Yeah. So Mitch looking for some matching. Obviously, we know they're... There's a cloud. Sky music boxing over the piranha there. And oh, Not right quite. side. Yep. Ugh. The Lone Island of Bale. I believe Mitch finished up that card. Picked up another camera. Yeah, he'll pick up whatever that inventory item was, and Mitch also gets the right path too. So, um, so he's gonna make up that item that Scott got earlier in the in the matching game, and also be on the path to success because Scott did get at least one of those camera items that Mitch didn't get. Right. So. I tell you, man, the randomizer for you. You have worlds where not much happens. They like seven, where it's just, just a mess. <laughs> you know, just a mess, man. There's pipes everywhere and multiple think, paths. Yeah, so many this options. Is, yeah, this is one of those things that you know. Again, the randomized pipes is a toggleable option in the actual randomizer software, but it's also one of those things that can help minimize, like maybe the advantage of the the more familiar runners of this game can have. It kind of negates that to, to RNG, basically, to kind of yeah. swing it back in, you know, more balanced gameplay, per se. Exactly. So, it's going to be a little challenging. Sky's going to definitely have to make Again, not going to be to take much advantage of her items. Maybe a cloud here. Again, we've seen that whole combination there of the skipping the Ford and music box. Again, skipping that item. Yeah, that could That's be in something. Piranha something valuable as well. Yep. I don't think Mitch has played that level all day yet. I don't think so. I think he's yeah. I think he's used that combination each time. So Mitch using a P uh, P wing there obviously making this just completely trivial now. Ludwig here. Got he's, got the ability, yeah. he's got the ability to stun. But the with the P wing it doesn't really much of a difference. So he's gonna go for the off screen kill to save some frames. There you go. And I'm pretty sure he's good enough on that one. So of course everybody knows you never jump for the wand because it does lose frames. But oh, yeah. if you get the off screen wand grab, when the scrolling begins, you instantly transport just like that. Saving all kinds of frames. Oh yeah. As Mitch oh. finishes up this world, Sky is right on its hills, finding the right path. Yeah, hopefully we can make the chat feel better because we have not had a we haven't had thick windy yet. And nope. I'm I'm gonna be a little saddened if we can't have that. Still have two more matches coming up after this. This other uh, second semifinal. Yeah, we'll be there. 
So again, uh, we'll see what happens here. Mitch having the lead right now in the six worlds. Sky likewise going to. God doesn't have a. Well, she does have it. She's. What is she going to do? She's going to call that music box song. Right? And just like Mitch, no shocking now. A very typical strat and randomizer. Just go ahead and P-wing over the yep. thing. You have it. You've got plenty of them anyway, so. Yeah, well, definitely see a lot, more, a lot more item usage and randomizer than you would a typical speed run. Just you got the items, you should use them. Oh, yeah. Not knowing what's coming up, which stage is coming up, which enemies are going to be in that stage. Yep. I said that yeah. safety. Yeah, definitely take notes, you all. You know, <laughs> you know. I mean, it's okay to play a randomizer, you know, for fun and stuff. But you know, this is a race, and they have to really. The items are really what make this race the race. You know, those key usage of items and knowing when to use them, when to gamble, when not to, all those kind of things. So, we are going to move on again. This is the third for those who are just joined the stream. You're late, first of all. Where you been? <laughs> And of course, we know that this is game three. They are playing the best of three. The winner will advance to the finals on Saturday. The loser will be battling between the bronze and the certificate of participation. And uh, so they are both fighting for their lives here. Mitch does lead right now. He's about two, and a, about two and a half cities ahead of Sky right now. Of course, they have varying inventory. Sky right. does have a, one more hammer. Which can come into play. I don't know if Mitch has a hammer right now. I haven't seen his inventory enough. He's got no. two. He's got two, so he's gonna have a chance to use one here at the upper part of World World Five. And, but he's got this auto scroller. And Mitch is gonna play it. Interesting. Could they take a death and go what to the fortress? Yeah. So typically, there are only two auto scrollers in the game that have been. Well, there's only two left. Five, nine, and one of the hidden levels. The lost levels. Right. So. Again, we don't know what the other one is. I'm pretty sure, I'm almost 100% certain if Sky sees this level, she's going to immediately die and just gamble the fort. She may she may cloud a lot of them, but again, this level is just... Ugh. Yeah. It's just a time, time sink. You know? It just it just feels like because you have to wait for the screen, you know? It's, it's like a minute plus. But nevertheless, he's through it. Yeah, the the level does not function correctly um, with that particular one being moved. He had a cloud too. He had a cloud and didn't didn't use it there. Yeah, maybe Mitch is being a little bit more hesitant on his inventory. Again, you know, right now, aside from people being tired of playing it, you know, in three <laughs> games back to back, you know, they have to be they may be a little bit more cautious as to using those godlike items here. And uh, as expected, Scott takes the death here. So she'll either cloud it or go play the Ford. So she's going to go find some kind of power up first, which is smart because she had right. to use it before she clouds. So there is no shock in her in her strategy there. They would make up some time there. Yeah, I'm very curious why Mish didn't do that. I don't yeah, know. Uh, either that or just choosing the fortress. But his decision has been made, and he's got to he's got to live with it now. Yes, indeed. So, oh boy, Hammer oh, Brother was taking refuge inside the block. Yeah. He said, you can't get me, bruh. Is he, is he invisible or invulnerable or invincible? He is a noun. Okay, okay. Just check it. <laughs> <laughs> so, Sky maintaining peace speed, so she had to worry about cartwheel Mario. And for those who don't know, when you are invincible, after having a star oh. man... You cannot mm -hmm. go on an upward-facing pipe unless you are a little or you have peace speed. Um, if you're if you cartwheeling, you cannot go on a pipe that faces downward. And those upward pipes, so you have to wait for it to end. Yeah, I didn't unless realize you're, that. Unless you're Frog Mario, because Frog Mario doesn't cartwheel. Yeah, I didn't realize that uh, going to the randomizer first time playing. I was like, oh, nice star, and then had to sit there and wait and realize what was going on. Yep. <laughs> Impenetrable, invest, <laughs> invincible. <laughs> That's what we just say when he has a star. There we go. Caesar there you go. Sky skipped over the fortress. Pretty common <laughs> strat. Oh my lord! 
Oh man, poor Heron bro just ran the tomato sauce. So they both grabbed the flowers here. <laughs> Inconceivable. No, you've been you've been the slot machine too much. So of course <laughs> Scott, you know, Scott used that cloud that Mitch didn't use. So she's, again uh, Scott said she's used that a lot. Just skipping over fortresses. Does not like playing fortress. Yeah. Again, that town that Mitch used to put all good kind of bad as well. He still has it. So even though it's very close right now, literally right. a second apart, we have a pretty different inventory. Uh oh. This guy picking up lies. Yeah, not really wanting that. So even though it's really close again, Mitch does have a cloud, so that's literally a whole level that can be skipped. Um, so that's gonna be an instant time gain. So long as he doesn't die after using it. It's... Right. Which is a scenario. Yeah. All right. So the big guy, another thick guy. Two hitter. <laughs> Validation five up. All righty. So we are headed off to world seven here. I believe it's Ice World, the longest. Yep. So again, cloud hammer usage is gonna be pretty important here. Again, we we don't know where the pipe. That's the first thing. Where the pipe gonna take us to? Right. Um, worst case scenario for to make it longer is gonna take us to that isolated island where we have to have the bridge built. Anything else, a hammer can skip part, or naturally we can skip the first third. Right. Both picking up a cloud uh, from Peach Toastal. Mm -hmm. So, so we'll have. yep. So Mitch is going to immediately cloud this one and Ooh. cloud another one. He's going to probably go. hammer the rock, so he's going to move very quickly with his map. Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, man. All right, I was going to say that uh, having all these items at the end of the end of the run here, here in World Seven, don't want to really hold on to them. So, no really other place to use them. Might as well use them now. Yep. So missions be a little careful here. You don't want to die. Some strategy. There is some strategy to holding on to some items like that in World 8. But then if they don't use it, if you don't use them, they're just wasted items. Yeah. And all that time you spent getting them is just, you know, in vain at that point. It's just. Yep. So, Mitch, watch out for the shoe. <laughs> oh, boy. Wouldn't that be a brutal way to end uh, that one? Yeah. God. Oh man. Got one enemy just waiting for you right before the, the goal. Alright, should I say Scott? Should I say on that one? So again, Scott, she's dealing with this auto scroll again. Ooh, she just makes it on there by a toenail yeah. that time. Yeah. Really close. Oh, rip the star. It's only Sage with a parabeetle. Yeah. So if you just got here, I ain't gonna tell you about that. <laughs> So this is the first. The, this is the um, first semifinals match. We're in game three of best of three, tied up one and all. Winner moving on to the semifinals. I'm um, so the semifinals. Final. So the, the finals yes. on Saturday. And of course, after this race, we will immediately go into our next semifinals. Like right now, not tomorrow, but like next. Between Classic Gamer and Duckfist, they're gonna battle as well. Maybe three. Oh man, walking. What was that? That was some crazy looking Goomba. A little freaky there. As you see, Fred has coded in brand new enemies with a random mouse. What a. <laughs> Just got a little confused there. Yeah. So Sky's going behind 1 3. This is a stage that Mitch skipped. Yep. Ooh. Box. Not now. No. Mm -mm. Can't really use that anymore. Yeah, unfortunately, Sky has had two bad breaks on trying to get an, an item that takes time in a level and not benefiting having a, a leaf in a music box. <clears throat> so here we go again. Mitch maintained that leaf. We have world to diverse again. Another another maze like world when we have randomized pipes. And uh, Mitch does have the hammer, so he will skip that for it and move right on 
to the final airship. Looking for the clip. Not quite there. Not that big of a deal. Just it would have been faster if you got it, but I mean that's a good thing. He's taking the normal path anyway. Yeah. Oh, that wasn't my throat. I'm sorry. That was my stomach. I'm hungry. <laughs> Better grab you a snack in between between <sighs> oh, yeah. matches. Give me a pack of Ritz crackers or something. Alrighty. Mitch, Mitch has got to avoid these bouncing balls. So wait for him to come back. There you yeah. go. Man, fun with hitboxes, man. You gotta love it. <laughs> that was a boy. four hit. Oh, was that Lemmy? Not Iggy. Yeah. One Lemmy. of those Koopa kids. Lemmy? Lemmy. There's out, he throws out three uh, bouncy balls. But if he still has another hit, those the remain playing to Avoid. So here we go. So Scabio's trailing. Mitch is Mitch is still going here. Moving into the um, final world here, world eight. So right now, the worst thing that Scabio's can and she doesn't know obviously where he, where he is. She probably has an idea. She may be behind, but I'm sure she's hoping that if he's ahead, that we do not have the best pipe scenario for world eight, which is. Having to play just one level, going north, and bam, we're on the battle screen. Right, and Toastal does give out a hammer uh, before entering World 8. Yeah, so he does so, have that option if needed. Yeah. So we're going to see if that comes into play. Last time he had a hammer with the world randomization of the pipes. It didn't even matter. So... Any pathing shenanigans? Well, we did have a different path. From... This is what put Sky a little bit behind. Even though she caught up by using a lot of clouds, but again, that's something that Mish didn't use. Yeah. And he used later to really build up the lead in the previous world. Of course, unfortunately, he's in his one of his favorite levels. I mean, for those who don't know, Mitch has just some of the prettiest movement I've ever seen in this game, using the hammer in 742. But... Gotta play a little slow here. Avoiding those yeah. fire prana plants. And Walk again, there. yeah, part of the randomization of this. Oh boy, God. Can't even get my thought out, man. <laughs> Mitch is over here testing the hitboxes on everything he sees lately. But of course, the piranhas do randomize. They could randomize the fire shooting. Try to eat it, just try to eat your face off. That so could make probably... some nasty combinations with uh, I mean, went on fireball patterns. And... Oof, yes, that middle section is just oh. yeah. So in typical fashion, damage boosting through the second, the beginning of the second screen, and just get just to get the boom boom be done with it. So here we go. Mitch is going to go see what the second pipe leads to here. Dark screen over be on the bridge screen and. So there's that lock he has, the hammer, which, of course, we just got. Right. Well, and, well... Not so a bad place to be. Yeah, definitely not. So, again, this right here, clearing this fortress unlocked the access to three different pipes. The one to the right of him in the dark that's behind the lock of this level. And, of course, the bottom two pipes. So the odds say... It's going to be one of those, you know, the odds. Right. But what are odds, anyway? It means nothing. <laughs> Dude, I'm telling you. It be anything. Yeah, because we, we haven't had a, re a hand bridge required seat to this, actually. Have Maybe not. it's time for one of those. Could be. Could be. These yeah. uh, set of pipes could lead in a loop. Have to go all the way back to the first pipe they entered, back to the hand bridge. And you know what? This is the kind of thing that has won a, again, very unlikely that someone will be that bold. But it's happened. There's one loop. And oh boy. There's the other side. So I have yep. to go through the action stages, stages one and two here. And here we go. Here. Yep. So our path is known, and now it's just a matter of getting through the stages. And of course, good old cheap cheap. Don't we all love this stage? Oh, yeah. 
I've seen these these cheap shoes. These cheap shoes are always here on the stage. I wonder why that yeah. is. I, it would be much more interesting to turn them all to false passes. <laughs> there you, you go. Just, just six of them running back yeah. and forth. I think I probably would glitch out the game though a little bit though. Too many sprites on the screen. It would look really cool though. It would. It would. You know, it'd be like a moving thwomp in the water. Some crazy looking sprite. <laughs> I knew we had some cheap, cheap people in the chat who had an emote. This guy used a hammer as well, past the lock, and then into this uh, dark area. Yeah. Mitch finishing up that second stage and onto the, the final fortress before Bowser. Yep, so it is looking a little favorable right now for Mitch. To looking like it. Come back. Two straight games here. Again, Mitch, a very, a very easy level for Mitch. Probably played this for way too many times to count. Couldn't even. Oh imagine. yeah. Oh yeah. You know, going through Fort One. Well, the only fort should I say in World Two. A little wall jump there. No reason yeah. to do that. <laughs> so I don't know, man. Just based on the routing choice, it looks like if Sky had not gone a different route and. Oh boy. Yeah, that seems to be the difference right now. Uh, uh, just not quite able to recruit. Even though having really good items, doing a, you know, getting good items with a matching card very, very early. I said that Route 3 was might have been the demise there. Again, it's amazing. Again, just something, you know, sometimes, you know, doing a, a good route choice and again becomes a gamble. Yeah. That's the randomizer. Sometimes it pays off, sometimes it doesn't. Mitch getting that clip. Mitch being a, a little slow here. Don't want to lose that. I, I, I can see why. No <laughs> idea where his opponent is going to Bowser. Doesn't want to lose his hand brother suit. Indeed. So Mitch Flower Power has. Well, he might die. He could somehow run out of time. He, is that still a thing? Yeah, when the timer is not moving, <laughs> nah. he may turn off his console. Oh, I was gonna say, yeah, I was gonna say he could like fall in the pit, but there's no pit. Yep. So Mitch Flower Power has done it. He has won the match. He has taken two games in a row to defeat Sky Bills with an official, oh man, Bubba, unofficially, until somebody officially confirms it. Forty-one minutes and thirty-seven seconds. Uh, GG to Mitch Flower Power. Moving on. To the finals, Sky making him work for it, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. Sky Bills took the first match. Mitch was able to bounce back and take two in a row. Yeah. He's, he's still alive. That first place. First place yeah, yeah. I know. And, you know, even even with Miss F Sky in World 3, I mean, this was still very, very close. I mean, very close. with her having, you know, she took time out. She had really, really good inventory. Oh, yeah. 